that range, he is 39%. That's beyond 16 feet. 39%. That's just way up from your past. So where was he in your past? 33. Uh, 30, way up. 34. Yeah. Now this Very guy comfortably from there. there. Griffin over Martin. Misses it. Anthony rebounds it. He's doing that a lot, as you, as you might imagine. Now, if you talked about his rebounds, but he's getting a lot of offensive rebounds as well. Bargnani in the paint draws the foul. Who shoot free throw? Fouls on Blake Griffin. Oh, kind of a silly move. Entire career there until the move to New York this year. And you'll pay absolutely no service fees or extra charges. Tickets start at just $15. Offers available online only at clippers.com backslash out of 11. And, and they aren't considered your best two players. So if you get that kind of production from your wings, you are going to have a good afternoon. And as it was, it was historic. Dalton to Bargnani, free throw line jumper is good. So Bargnani has all six so far for the Knickerbockers from everywhere. Is it sets up at NBA.com, like yeah. all that fancy stat stuff? Yeah, it'll show you like a heat index, like a red area where he scores a lot from. But it's it's so balanced from right to left. Bargnani. I'll tell you what, they look good. Maybe well, they're... When the shots are falling, they tend to look good. They've made seven. Jameson. Head down, drive to a hole, the left hand missed the shot, the rebound taken by J.R. Smith. Who can pull up from anywhere. To a goal town. Get the basket to Barnett. Tell you what, the Knicks look good. Ball against Felton. Bullock, DeAndre Jordan, go to the hole, finger roll won't fall. Long rebound off to J.R. Smith of the Knicks. Griffin's running ahead. Dudley the trailer for three. Won't go. It's a really tough three to shoot. You almost never practice a three catching it over your shoulder and firing on the run. Marignani. A good shot if he makes that one. Two-point ball game. Because the Knicks are on a run. I don't know that you want to pull up and shoot a three unless you absolutely know your feeling. Marignani gets the roll. Oh, 11th in a row. The Clippers are up by 11 and 40 to 29. Now we're tied at 40. Does not look like a team that's lost six ball games in a row. He was really only a couple of hours longer. So what the heck? And he's not playing coach on a commercial airline by that. The foul of Bargnani goes to the hole. Foul's going to be against the other. He's from Italy. He's good. good. Draft. Andrea will try again. 27 seconds to go. Makes both foul shots. And it's up over here with Doc Rivers. Down the lane. He'll go. Gets the shot blocked by Bargnani with eight tenths of a second. And even with that little bit of time, Doc Rivers is going to take a 20 second timeout because he can't carry that into the second half. He get one in the first half. He get one in the second half. You know. Use it, you lose it. Boy, it looked like Chris was beyond Bargnani, but as they say, size matters. <laughs> You're seven feet, you can make up a lot of ground on a guy six foot one. It was a left hand bounce pass, and he reacted to it and got it there. Melton down the lane, chases the ball, goes to Bargnani. Again, they have awakened the Knicks. So at the ball, they're Griffin. They didn't get a whistle. I mean, Jamal thought he traveled. Well, Jamal jumped up and down, came down with it. Look at the Knicks bench. He was waiting for the whistle. Blocked by Bargnani. Ranks number three in the league. In yeah. the Ten on the shot clock. Crawford inside to Jordan. Go up in traffic, Bargnani gets his third block. Open look, and he can always create that. 15 points, but for lead. Finally, holding the Knicks at bay. Well, the Knicks need to make a shot somehow. They missed six in a row. Bargnani spins it in. He's like barely triple it hard. He's been good. Anthony's been good.